oh my gosh i look so pretty anyways morning guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you don't know me now you do my name is now and in today's video we're doing a spend a day with me as a university student right so i haven't done uh university student content in quite a long time because there hasn't been school cool and besides that there was nothing to like really vlog because we're doing everything online and being here at home um you know there's basically nothing to like vlog so today there's actually something to vlog because i'm writing on campus for the first time since i started my degree so this is my third year and this is the first time writing on campus and this was, would be the third time on campus and this time would actually be like um a real day where i actually go to class i go to write my um test and whatever so i want to take you guys along with me and i hope you'll enjoy today's video but before you do so just a quick reminder please do not forget to subscribe to my channel as i had said in my previous video we're on our way to 2000 subscribers so please do make sure that you subscribe you like my video you do what needs to be done and yeah let's get into the video <laughs> First thing first, I want to open my curtain so that there's like sunlight. Let me quickly open. So as I had said, I wanted to like quickly open my curtains because I wanted some, you know, lighting and stuff and I really like the lighting except um, my window has barking back or whatever so you know not really piece pieces are sunlight on my body but that's okay anyways um as i said i'm going to campus today i am very excited but nervous at the same time because um the whole time we've been writing online and today's the first time writing physically on campus so yeah it was just a lot going on i spent the whole night studying i only slept at three o'clock and i woke up at six and then i had to like you know kind of do some touch-ups on my studying i think it's after seven right now i'm not sure but i think it's after seven and i want to quickly make something to eat and i want to go bath and i want to head out because i want to get there as soon as i can get there because it's the first it's the first time really being there like i don't know where the classes are so i'd rather be very early than be late so i just want to get to campus at around um maybe warm up 20 to 9 10 to 9 whatever it is so that i can actually have time on campus to locate my class and you know have just a bit of time on campus you know do a bit of studying and yeah so i'm gonna take you guys along with me i want to quickly make breakfast which is something that is going to be easy i'm going to make my instant porridge let me show you what i eat in the morning i feel like this is the quickest thing you could ever have you know except i know there are like a lot of quick things to eat but i think this is the quickest and i really love it i don't like this one in particular this one i don't like this one in particular because it's i don't know but there's another one i think he like ace yeah i think it's ace i like that one more, more because it tastes really good so i'm gonna quickly make some tea and then whilst i boil the water i'll quickly go make my bed Story time. 
so I'm gonna do it as quick as I can because it's not really a long story um, so today is Wednesday right on Monday I woke up you know in the best mood ever I told myself that this week I was gonna wake up early. I was gonna do that goal this week, you know, I was gonna go take my morning walks and I was gonna go, you know, um start my day early and you know get things done this week. So on Monday I wake up early. I had studied on Sunday, I actually slept at around one on Sun on my on Sunday, Monday morning, right? And then I wake up on Monday at half past five. I could take my walk for about an hour or so and then I come back. And then I, you know, attend a workshop, I attend my daily class, and I was actually writing at one. So I start writing my test at one, everything is, you know, all set, all good. So when it's time to actually submit my test, the document goes missing. Like, the document went missing. I'm trying to submit, like, I had, like, limited time. I think I had, like, five or ten minutes to like submit my work and that document was just missing it was nowhere to be found on my laptop so now i'm not sure whether to like you know talk to the lecturer about this whole thing because i'm nervous because you know he had actually set the rules before writing that you know he's not gonna accept certain things and 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 so now i didn't submit my test and i'm just here wondering like what i should do should i go talk to him you know i think one thing about me like i'm so scared of like you know being disappointed and stuff like that and i don't like being scolded at so i don't know whether to like go consult him because i was even thinking of writing him an email but i'm like what if he scolds at me what if he tells me where to get off actually because you know he had actually set the rules and he had said that you know like things are serious so he doesn't take you know any excuses and stuff like that so i'm sitting here wondering by the way the test counts 10 percent which is a lot 10 percent is a lot 10 percent is a lot in university you actually need that 10 percent for something so in my head i'm like should i tell him and see what he says maybe he'll give me a chance or should i not say anything and make sure that on my next test i work my you know as of you know i work very hard and make sure that you know i basically recover those marks that i've lost i'm like gosh i don't know what to do but yeah that's the story of my life let me get to my eating and i just want to quickly um just uh skim and scan my work so that i remember certain things for the test to open this umbrella I remember the other day like because i couldn't open this thing i don't know when you press i don't know what you do like i'm just going to oh, okay i see it now i see it um i think we should get going because okay i was gonna be right if i continue doing whatever that it is that i'm doing um that's how I look basically. Hey guys, I'm gonna get going right now. Um, I'm a bit early, but as I said, 
uh better early than late so let me get going so that um i'm not late basically sitting like a little while now it's very awkward to like vlog in public but what can i say i'm waiting for my classmates uh, i just finished writing the test i wrote well by the way but i'm waiting for my classmates so that we can like discuss our assignment and then i can head home i can't wait to get home though like it's very awkward being here so yeah, let me go wait a bit closer so that they can spot me once they finish writing. <laughs> previous clip that you have seen i was actually by gate two buying food um you guys who are in the university of Liverpool will know what a gate two gig i know but i was there and yeah i went to buy food so now i'm waiting for the dog eh? i'm waiting for the doctor and then after that i want to go home uh, I was actually buying this part of cake too, so I'm gonna eat it when I get home. I'm very tired. I am so tired, but overall, I had a very exciting day. Um, <clears throat> I met my classmates for the first time, and it was very exciting, you know. Like, I got to chat to some of them, it was very nice. I'm actually looking forward to, you know, going back to campus full time because it's actually nice interacting with people. It's been that long since I've, like, you know, been in a space where I interact with people, so I'm very, very excited. Um, yeah, but I'm still at the doctor now, so. I just arrived home and I'm very tired. I just want to eat. Let me show you how squashed up my spargo is. My heart. Look. Look. I think it's because I was at the, at the doctor for a very long time. Like, they took their time, those people. Like, that doctor wasn't coming. We had to wait for him for like over an hour, but I did what I had to do. And I also got my meds, so I have to take my medication later on. And yeah, so this is where I'm gonna end the vlog. I'm going to eat, I'm going to sleep, I'm going to relax because it's been one good, tiring day. So I think it was tiring because I've been walking right, like I walked so many steps from there to here. So I'm just gonna rest. So I hope you guys just enjoyed this little mini vlog of mine. If you don't, please do make sure that you subscribe. You give it a thumbs up, you comment down below, do whatever that needs to be done. Till the next time, I'm out.